This video is going to teach you how to transfer content from your Bridge to Career Digication ePortfolio site into a new Google site um, that you will create. So uh, before I start this instruction, uh, let me be honest and tell you that there is no simple way to transfer this content from one place to another. It involves a lot of copying and pasting from your existing education site into your new Google site page. It also involves a lot of downloading of files from your existing education page and then um, saving it into your computer and then re-uploading it into your Google sites. So here we will see um, that I have opened up a typical Bridge to Career site and this is a template. Um, what I want you to notice is the structure over here, uh, the page structure which the temple template contains and I'm sure uh, most of you have the same kind of structure in your individual education. Uh, what we will be doing is we are going to recreate this same structure into your Google Sites. So I am now going to go into a Google Sites page and here um, this sites area you can get access through your email Google app icon and then um, once you reach there you will click on new Google Sites and then on this big orange button to create a new site okay we can name this site um, I'll name it bridge to career okay on the upper right hand side you have a link called pages we're going to use this area to create the structure of your site so you will notice in your digication site you have various uh, pages called home resume bridge to career outcomes we're going to go ahead and we're going to create the same structure in Google Sites. We're going to click on page and then on this add page icon. And then we are going to call this, um, since we already have a home page, we are going to call this page your resume page. The next page we are going to call it uh, bridge to career outcomes and then save that so if you go ahead and publish your site um, you will be asked to name uh, a, a site location you can go ahead and name it anything I am going to name it um, this is already taken so I'm going to name it same 2000 just arbitrarily uh, this name has to be unique and then we're going to just go ahead and publish it okay if I click on uh, publish once again and then if I want to preview my site I can do that and then you will see on the upper right hand pages this is the structure which you have noticed earlier in your digication page the same structure has been reflected here and you will in due course add all the pages that you have in your dedication um, site into Google Sites. So you're going to build the structure here according to the structure that you already have in your dedication site. Okay, now um, about transferring the content from dedication into Google Sites. So as I said earlier, there is no easy way. Uh, what you need to do is basically go ahead and copy and paste this content into your digication site. So if I am in uh, my, um, this was a homepage content, I'm going to go ahead and click on homepage in Google Sites and then I'm going to click and add the text. Simply paste it and then publish it.
Now, if you had any, uh, in your Digication page, if you had any uh, file upload in the form of a PDF or a Word document um, or a, a Excel spreadsheet, what you needed to do is um, download that in that uh, document in your computer and then re-upload it into your Google Sites. There is another way uh, in which you can download the entire content of your Digication portfolio on your computer and I will show you that. You can go to ePortfolio Tools and then choose Download and then click on Download and then choose a location and then save it. So what this does is it essentially saves the entire content of your Digication ePortfolio as a zip file in your desktop. So here, here you will see the um, Digication file has been downloaded as a zip file on your desktop. So I'm going to, down, um, I'm going to download that and see what's inside the folder. Unzip the file and then double click and you'll see all the files which were previously in your Digication ePortfolio. So now if you had any PDF file or any Word file, uh, then that would show up here. And then what you would do is then you would go back to your Google Sites and then you would uh, manually re-upload that file into your Google Site page. Okay, um, so I'm going to go back to the Google Sites page. So, um, so here is how you're going to transfer that content. Like I said, there is no easy way. It is a manual process. So uh, this was how you could transfer the content from your Digication ePortfolio pages into a new Google site.